So currently, every time I touch the wall, my health change by one. And it's not a lot of code to have to repeat. However, there's something fundamentally wrong that when we have to copy the code multiple times in the same in in the entire um, program. The reason for that is because if you decide that, oh, I want to remove more health points every time I touch the wall, then you have already four locations where you have to change it. But imagine that, you know, changing the health is much more complicated than that. You have to not only change the variable, but you also want your player to say, ouch, or and then you have some other instructions. So, you know, your code could be much bigger. So this is why we want to use what we call encapsulation where basically instead of saying change health by and then all the rest of the code you will want to say reduce health and then reduce health will, will call a block where all the instructions pertaining to reducing the health would happen so how do I do that well in each of those section if you go all the way to the bottom, you have something that says make a block, where you can create a block of that color. So you have to really think about what kind of block I want to create. Well, here in my, per in my uh, program, I would like to create a new block that is going to take care of changing the value of the health. So I'm going to put it in variable. So I'm going to create make a block and um, it's going to be invaluable and it's going to be a command because we're not going to return anything so and I'm going to call it reduce health you could decide that it's for all sprites or for this sprite only here it's only for this sprite only and now I have a new window that basically says, well, okay, what do you want to put in this particular new block? Well, I want to change the health by one. And let's say that we want to create something else. Let's say that we also want to say, ouch, let's just touch the wall. So we have at least two instructions. We say apply. Okay, now when we are in this script, every time I'm going to go into variable, I see my new block, reduce health, and I can put it over here. I'm going to remove, remove all of those instructions and instead call reduce health. So the good thing with that is that if I decide that I want to be a little tougher on my on my player and I want to actually remove more than just one health point every time we touch the wall, I can go back and edit and say, well, you know what? Every time you touch the wall, I'm going to reduce your health by 10 points. And now it applies for everywhere we're calling this particular block. That's what we call encapsulation, and it's very useful.